Um, you guys got this. <laughs> Everyone's dying. Wee 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 wee. I need to do it. Wee wee. What am I doing, right? <laughs> <laughs> Red Dead Redemption 1. We're in Mexico. That's all that matters. And we just got back to America, but I'm going back to Mexico because they treat me better there. They actually love me. I'm lying. They all hate me. <laughs> they keep calling me mean names. <laughs> Whoa. I know I'm sexy. I know I'm cool. I know I'm black. But yeah, Red Dead Redemption 1. That's the intro, bro. I'm losing my mind. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you aiming your gun at me? What is your problem? Why was he aiming his gun at me? Civilization at any price. What do you want, gringo? What are you look, doing here? Look, look, what did I do to them? Have you heard? There's a war going on. My name's John Marston. I've been sent here to retrieve a couple of men. Can I speak to your commander? They're gonna laugh at me, huh? You want to talk to my boss, gringo? I guess. Because I'm not good enough for you? I don't know who you no, are. Sir. You think you're better than me? I, bro, no. You come to my country. My poor little country. This is how every conversation and you goes. Think you couldn't be friends with the president? Oh, sir. So I'm sorry, sir. Not every conversation Things goes. supposed to come out wrong. Maybe you can help me. You'll be sorry, friend. Maybe we can help each other. Don't. <laughs> relax, I mean, relax. <laughs> sure. Out. Somewhere between a threatening stare and the soldier's arm to the teeth. Yeah. Yeah, you had me. Welcome to Mexico, amigo. Let's come eat, drink, and then we'll talk. My name is Capitan Vicente de Santa. John Marston. My country is in pain, John Maston. Terrible pain. The rebels have seized the people by the throat and destroyed a way of life. I'm no politician, sir. <laughs> Hell no, man. What the fuck, man. Why are you looking at me like that? But we are both beholding. Oh, you got to get a freaky, huh? Okay. A brave man. Perhaps you have heard of him. Coronel Alande. He's trying to preserve the order in our province to keep our civilization alive it is tough the people are confused and usually swayed sometimes in the yeah of what is right you gotta do terrible things it breaks my heart I also am no moralist, sir. I wish I enjoy your freedoms, Mr. Marston. I'm trying to find a man, an American, an outlaw named Bill Williamson. I believe he came here to seek protection from another outlaw named Javier Escuela. You're no moralist, but you hunt outlaws? So it would seem. You heard anything of these men? I am the government, or what is left of it. Outlaws seek each other. They're possibly hiding with thieves and killers who pose as freedom fighters in the hills around here. They're united under one traitor named Abraham Reyes. Where could I Abraham find Reyes. Reyes. If I knew, I would be there, hunting him with everything that is true within me. Reyes finds you. Like cholera. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> But it's possible, though. My men are trying to lure him into a trap. Possibly you could ride with us. I'm here. And if everything goes okay, I'm sure the coronel will help you. Okay. Vámonos! You can take your horse. Right on the wagon. Warm shotgun. Let's work for me, man. I need to like stretch, you know. Go ahead, bro. Thank you, big dog. Wee, 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 wee. Oh. Oh. 
You did not expect such a warm welcome from the Mexican army. I can see. I didn't know what to expect. I hadn't even crossed the border and I was being shot at. You will hear a lot of words like tyrant and oppression here. Words of the peasants have been taught, but do not understand meaningless words. The army is suffering uh, a crisis of reputation. Even I've heard about the colonel down here. He's not famous for his compassion. This is the point. Have you met Coronel Allende? Do you know him? No. Like a papagayo? He just repeat lies you heard. Baby. Allende is a good man, a strong man. He carries the weight of a million problems on his shoulders. Am I supposed to pity him? You gringos are so quick to judge. You love to talk badly of other people because it makes you feel better about yourselves. No. You should look in the mirror. I just like talking talk bad. About this. And I ain't here to make judgment on the way of your government. I've got enough problems with my own right now. This isn't America, Senor Master. We are poor. Kindness must take a different form. What is better? To pull your arm around a hungry man? Or to be him until he grows some food to eat? What? I think you need to answer that question yourself. <laughs> Who are these aloes you hunt? This Billy, the cowboy, and his Mexican friend. Bill Williams is a fella I used to know, and Javier Escuela, well, I knew him too. What do you mean? You know this man? We was friends once. Part of the past I can't seem to get rid of. The past is all that's real, my friend. They cannot be erased. That is the problem with the people here. They spend too much time dreaming about imaginary futures. I know I can't change the past, but I'm sure gonna do something about the future. Whatever helps you to sleep at night, amigo. My country is full of American criminals, mostly in the service of the rebel peace. Mexico is an easy place for men to lose himself, whether he wants to get lost or not. Hopefully not too easy. They ain't got much time to find these men. There must be a high price on their heads. The highest price? Can I ask how much? I'm not getting paid. It's... it's a long story. I'm being made to do this. I will never understand you Americans. Me neither. We have a system of law in Mexico, senor. And we do not tolerate people who think they can run with their own. However, if you help us, we help you. No one hides from Coronel Allende for long. Okay. This rebellion, it is a disease. It is killing this country. Don't the people have the right to stand up for themselves? The right? The right? Don't you throw silly ideas Huh? What do you know about the rights of the Mexican people? <laughs> Very little. Just saying, there must be something behind this rebellion. I'll tell you what's behind there, Senor Marston. Lies. Insidious lies. The peasants are stupid, and like cows, they can be hurting. It only takes a few men to move many. Maybe they've just had enough of being called stupid. Yeah, man. Talking about things you don't understand. You I'm just an outsider, bro. I'll give you an answer. Are you a revolutionary? Is that why you're here? I was once, I suppose. In a twisted kind of way. I thought I could change something if I fought hard enough. Change what? I don't know. Maybe that was the problem. Revolution is always selfish. It is nothing but greed and ego. Individuals putting their own needs above those of others. It Sounds like Dutch. Fighting for change when they have no idea what change is. If you're a poor man who's been beat down all his life, any change is gonna seem good. What? You think that over <laughs> the government is going to make a poor <laughs> Everything we say sounds it's normal, he's just like... <laughs> natural, they're gonna look for someone else who will. For a tired old revolutionary, you are very naive. What do you want us to do? Walk around giving out money to every poor person in Mexico? <laughs> what a terrible idea. First, they need to look at why they're poor. Then they need to go out and do some work rather than sitting on their culos talking about freedom. Mm -hmm. Who's this man we're looking for? The leader of the rebels? Abraham Reyes. He's a traitor, a liar, a coward, and a sinner. A hero who has done nothing. I have full more respect for the shit I look this morning than I ever will for that pathetic worm. That's a nice image. He is from a rich family. A man born in a golden cradle. Who pretends to fight for the poor is taking advantage of the ignorant and the weak-minded. He must be telling the people something they want to hear. Of course he is. 
all that bastard does is stand in a balcon giving speeches. It is easy to make promises you can never keep. It takes more than a few promises to build an army. It's not far now. Are you ready? ready Always. We will lure the rebels into a trap. There's a train leaving to Parosa soon. We're going to escort it. They will think it's a supply train. There are no supplies on it. Very clever. We must throw that rat out of their holes. If there's some bait they can refuse. Come on! The train is waiting. <sighs> We're Tabitha. Come on, Tabitha. Everybody say hi to Tabitha. I'm waiting. Do it. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Tabitha. Got him. Did you lift through two? I guess you are a big man. Look out! More rebels! That's enough, my friend! Oh, I thought I got hit by a train. It's gonna take more than one of you, partner! On the east! I got us. Don't worry about it. Dang, they take like three shots! Some thick boys! Jeez. I don't see nothing, man. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. Don't spam me. Don't spam me. Don't spam me. I'm learning. I'm learning. Um. Los rebeldes están robando el tren. Levántese, perezoso, que yo para que le estoy pagando. Marston, you're gonna have to do something. What? You have to go out there and start the train before it crosses the bridge. Yeah. Todavía levántese. Usted también. Muévase. ¿Qué le pasa a usted? Ay, Dios mío, levántese. Ya mismo. Am I the only one about to do it, bro? Everybody else too drunk. They don't want to do it no more. They tired of this one. Dang, that's a lot of them. Hold up. Hello. <laughs> yep, John Marston alone. Oh, they about to, oh, that's a. John Marston, bro. John Marston, people. John Marston. John Marston, incredible human being. Thought about it, it is 50% in the game and I have not seen my family once. <laughs> All these episodes, I have not seen my family, not once. The demon drink. Are we about to burn thing? Llorón, maricón, me das asco. Hablas lealtad, pero eres transparente. Estarás aplaudiendo cuando mi cabeza está en pelado, ¿verdad? No, 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 mi excelencia. Mis hombres y yo estamos trabajando noche y día por su honor. ¿Honor? ¿Qué eres, un muchacho? Jovencito sin vergüenza. ¿Qué diablos es este cabrón? That's, that's the man who helped us defeat Reyes. The man I spoke to you of. <laughs> a friend of Mexico. Hello, sir. Hola, gringo. So you are the bounty hunter, huh? Have you found your prey yet? No, sir. Ah, perhaps you come to hunt me, huh? Your country no. loves to make trouble in mine. But what? Perhaps, but it isn't so. Ah, perhaps I should tie you to a horse 
and let it drag you around town. Dude, I promise you, dogs fight you huh? I will murder you right here. Then see what you say. I'd say the same thing. I'm here to bring two men to justice, nothing more. Your politics or ideas of entertainment are not my concern. Yeah, I suppose not. But it's on two years. Sinceramente, espero que me encontraste alguna compañía más interesante que ese bruja que me traíste anoche. Let me ask you this, sir. Do you know anything of the men I'm looking for? Escuela is from this province. His uh, father was a borracho, a drunk who worked as a laborer on land cultivated by my uncle. Men like that are natural allies for Reyes. Mm -hmm. My people have lived and worked here for a hundred years. We brought civilization. And these people, these fucking monkeys, despise <clears throat> us. We brought them God. And they turned their back on him. Now I fight to help them from themselves, to save them from themselves. I see in their faces that they would kill me if they could. <laughs> they she only a tyrant. That is the way it is. These people need a ruler. Well, sorry to hear that. Yeah, I don't really care, bro. I'm not gonna lie. It is a way of mankind. A fight between two forces. Que sera, sera. What will be, will be. But I know one thing, Senor Marston. Force, <laughs> force must be used if you are to have your own way. I'm sure. Now, perhaps you can uh, do me a favor while I yeah. find these men for you. Mm -hmm. After we find the men, then I'll help in any way I can. Ah, that, 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 that. You are in no position to negotiate. Now, por favor, a bunch of these idiots men are fighting at Tesoro Azul. You head there and you lend your support. Baboso, ¿cuántas veces voy a decirte? No ponga detrás de mí. I don't even know what he's saying, but he. It don't sound good. Follow me. We must hurry. Yeah, let's get away from you. See, you you were like praising him, bro. He's he not nice to you, man. I'm gonna need a translator in the comments. <laughs> so I finally met your great leader. He certainly lives up to his reputation. What would you know about leadership? Only that most can't handle power. It is easy to criticize power when you have never had it yourself. And you still on his balls. You have never been in the presence of a strong man before. I have definitely not with you. Your country in the newspapers. Men printing and decorating themselves like women. Vanity is the legacy the British left behind. Look, I don't know the fella. Just saying. That's how he treats his own men. Coronel Allende controls any situation he's in because he knows that situation can never be allowed to control him. It is what a leader must do. And in case you had not noticed, we're fighting a war. We're all under a lot of pressure. Pressure to find young girls? The Coronel needs recreation like everyone else. He does not have time to court women. He's waging a war on ignorance. And it's impatient for victory. He's you are just like wisdom in those sucking him, bro. We must hurry. You Americans think you can ride? Do you? Come on. I will race you there. Right behind you. Yeah, behind. Remember that. That's like his whole ball sack just down his throat. Like, bro, shut up. Close to the Sora Sul now. If my men are dead, the rebels will all die. If they're alive, they have failed me. And the rebels will all die. Right behind you. How the heck are you going to try to put like a, a voice thing in the middle of a race? I'm No, back up. I win. You yeah. suck, loser. I hope you fight better than this little girl, gringo. Come, let's have some fun. <sighs> Look at John just standing there. He doesn't care. Kill me! What 
the heck? You can just switch like that? I did not know you could just like flick your stick and it just like it, it automatically goes to the next person. Remember, nobody takes them before Allende. We did all this just to get women for Allende? <laughs> no, that's just a bonus. This village is riddled with rebels. Make sure they don't have homes to come back to. There are fire bottles over there. Use them to burn down some of these houses. And what makes you think I'd do that? You want to find Javier Escuela, don't you? John, you're helping Mexico. Vámonos, muchachos. Buen trabajo. Yo me quedo aquí para vigilar el gringo, Capitán de Santa. Get the fire bottles. It is time to finish what we started. Thank you. Speak American. <laughs> oh, now we have. Oh, okay. Look at us unlocking things. Now the next one. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. All right, there you go. Isn't that beautiful? You really are pathetic. You need to relax. Come back to the villa and sample some of the new girls before they spoil. I have a wife, bro. Chill out. Come back between 7 a.m. and 10 p.m. I'm going to stab. Another uh, one fit the down the drain. Another one fit the down the drain, man. Dang, this game bright. Oh my gosh. I ain't put I ain't put no filter on. Don't say nothing about me. This is the game. Why is it so white? My eyeballs. Yo. Jeez. Where are we going? Mr. Mustang, right with us. Where? We've been betrayed. Bye. If there's no time, ride with us. Okay. We'll find the main you seek. Come. It's just like, it's There's always like something Come, before. I know people are telling me this game is like slow or I guess they said it's like, it's a slow start, but. What's the hurry, DeSanta? Hey, there we go. Damn. The what the what did he do? A place called Torquemada. We can allow them to establish a stronghold. The Coronel has given me urgent orders. Which are? To kill them all. I should have guessed. Ride with me. We have a long journey ahead of us. Two hours later. Yeah. Stone, wake up. We're almost there. All right. I saw a trailer for Spider-Man multiplayer. Stay alert. Something doesn't feel right. Ah. Cover up. We need to get to the camp. Get, get, get. Oh my gosh, that's what happened to the person that leaked it. No. Ah! Let's see what mess that idiot Espinosa has made. See that deranged captain at Tesoro Azul? Is he leading this attack? He? Espinosa does not lead anything. I thought he was the same rank. He is an angry dog who let out to run sometimes. That is all. I'm in charge here. You're lying to yourself. Beautiful birds. Follow me. Let's get things started. Let's get things started. Oh, you're back. Speak American. Shut your mouth, office boy. Bingo. Take that sniper rifle over there. We have men's work to do. Okay, see rolling block See if this was if I was on PC man, I'd be like ooh wee no Butt shot Dead That didn't even touch him. I wait how close can I I'm never using this thing again. Never, never using this thing again. Never using that thing again. Oh, look at that. We almost, do we have all? We have all the stuff now. Or not all the guns in the game, but you know, all the slots. Damn. 
I ain't holding nothing. I'm pushing. We ain't never gonna be friends now. Move never. Forward. You must have a real bad death win. Uh, sir, your head. Just peek it again. Just go ahead. <laughs> what up, bro? Jesus Christ, I did a lot of damage. Um, you guys got this. <laughs> Everyone's dying. No, I'm here to live. Climb. Oh my! Was that the sniper? Alright, so the bullet just went through him. Is that a Gatling? Oh, that's a sniper. I'm just trying to make sure I shoot everybody at least once before I get sniped in the throat. I don't think none of these people got snipers. Never mind. Matenlos, por Dios. No dejen ningún sobreviviente. Look at all the people coming. I'm about the net. Oh no. Oh, I'm about the net. Oh, I'm about the net. Oh, 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 oh. Are those sieves? Nope, those are not sieves. Hello, dude. Where does get achievement? Long arm Marston. Does it tell you what the demons were? Nope. A night. Wonder if this works. That did nothing. <laughs> uh, isn't this supposed to be your team? Look at you behind me. Help! Alive? You knew this is how it had to be. You must be the pendejo that you cared about. Ooh. Un hombre, lo que sea, mujer. Amigo, amigo, qué pasa? Ah, ah, killer like you deserves fine women and wine. The best pleasures Earth can give a man. <laughs> I need some information, DeSanta. All in good time. <laughs> Bro, John, you need to start like uh, sending your grant and start killing people. The next time I see you, I need some answers, Captain. <laughs> go get drunk, go get a woman, enjoy life. It's a beautiful struggle. <laughs> <sighs> Marston, please stand your ground, John. John, please stand your ground and just start killing people. I'm full on with you. We just kill everybody here. And then I gotta use a Gatling gun, bro. <laughs> oh, my God, I don't do this no more. Andeles lindas y patrióticas. Dale, que ustedes son putas si lo saben. Por favor. Oh, mi amor, nadie te está obligando a hacer nada. Solamente quiero que animes al hombre que va a salvar a tu padre. ¿Tú quieres a tu padre, cierto que sí, linda? What's going on here, Captain DeSanta? Just a little recruitment. Nothing for you to be concerned about. 
You boys using women soldiers now? Our customs are none of your concern. Apparently not. The Santa Mariconcito! Me encontraste algunas chicas! Ay, mamacita! ¿Dónde has estado toda mi vida? Ve, ve, mujeres! Ve, ay, me gusta! The two patriots were keen to make your acquaintance, ah, the coronel. Fantastic! I love patriots! Ah, hey, Sergeant Marston! You here to fight the war? And we shall make a patriot of you yet! I hope so. Any word of those men? Oh, yes. I heard they were riding with Reyes. I wanted to talk to you about it. Uh, the Santo, uh, hable con él. Tell him what I wanted. Huh? <laughs> His Excellency, El Coronel, would like to employ you in escorting a train down rebel country. The job is dangerous. But well, you'll have the honor of... <laughs> Another patriot? Of knowing that you said Mexico... I don't care. Against forces I just want... That would destroy our society. How much you offer? 20,000 pesos. And information as to the whereabouts of Javier Escuella. Okay, then. Bro, I don't like how you're looking at me, bro. Hey, bro, I got a wife. Chill. She has a funny way of showing it. Oh. Oh, you two are. Oh, my fault. Go ahead. Hurry. We must go. So it looks like it is me and... Yeah, why his neck like that? <laughs> Look at him in the back. Thinking my dance card was full. What do you mean? Just that it's a pleasure to see such a noble patriot at work. Your sarcasm is childish and pathetic. This is an important assignment. I get I better get 20. Deliver these munitions to Chuparosa. They will help to finally crush the rebels. I hate to break it to you, Captain, but I think you're gonna need a lot more than this. I know. Most of the supplies are already in Chuparosa. We will deliver them all by train to our base camp in Yes Coronas. Our forces are close to establishing control in that region. Why didn't DeSanta come with us? Why do you think? Because he is hardly a soldier. I'm sure he has other important business, like mailing letters and sweeping floors and flirting with firemen. He fought with you at Are you defending that pathetic little errand boy? I did not see him fight. Without me, we would have lost the battle. He knows less than nothing on how to lead men. Yet he's the colonel's second. Yeah, so how did he get that? That is a good job. You are a funny man, gringo. This Santa licks the colonel's boots and plays with his waiter friend. That is all. I am again this brazo derecho, his right arm. I am one of the few men he respects. Is that right? You and him have something special, do you? The colonel needs a maid, a woman he cannot fuck. This Santa is that woman. Do you mean like literally or like? The battle at Torquemada was hard, but the Soro de Azul, that was some fun. Am I right, gringo? Fun? Burning people's homes, killing innocent people? That's your idea of fun? When a woman picks up a rifle, and a child picks up a rifle, they become soldiers. Those are the rules of war. They ain't my rules. So you would allow a woman to shoot you? That makes you an idiot, not a gentleman. Does it seem quiet to you? I don't know. Oh, somebody about to get blown up. You've not seen a single rebel yet. I'd say that's a good thing, wouldn't you? I mentioned a Spider-Man trailer leak. Dude, right in front of me blew up, bro. I don't want to talk about it. No. No! I'm not talking about it for the rest of the video. I'm not talking about it for the rest of the video. What the? I cannot see any more of them. Oh my gosh. I'm not, we're not bringing that up anymore, okay? Maybe another video. Not this one, bro. Not this one. That no. Close. I don't know. This doesn't feel right to me. We're on our way to escort a train through rebel-held country. An ambush feels about right to me. Soldado! ¿Quién eres? ¿Cuál escuadrón? Somos nuevos reclutas, Capitán. Es nuestra primera asignación. I knew I had not seen these men before. They are new recruits. In Escalera, people have been talking about the rebels planning a large attack. If these supplies are so important, why have we been given so few soldiers? Don't ask me. You're Is it a setup? I thought you were supposed to be fearless. I am fearless, but not brainless. The 
There is something wrong. I feel it. Maybe you just need to take a piss or something. The colonel told me that the Santa had praised my actions at Torquemada and called me a hero. He asked for me to be given this important assignment. Why would he do that? The cabron hates me! Yeah, but doesn't everybody hate you? Maybe we should turn back or wait for reinforcements. If Belinde says he knows where Javier Escuela is, we More of them! They are above us! This is definitely a setup. Is that our trade? Yes, it seems to be on schedule. At least one thing is going right for us. I agree. We ain't off to a good start. You shoot well, gringo. Tell me something. What is your weapon of choice? What do you mean? Come, my friend. <laughs> your belt is full of weapons. Which is your favorite for attacking a man? You ain't right in the head, Captain. Do you want to know what mine is? Not particularly. Truth. You're ridiculous. We are close to Chuparrosa now. I still have a bad feeling about this. Tell me, why are you here? What did they promise you? 20,000 pesos of Javier Escuela. That is a lot of promises. Do you know where Escuela is? You think I am going to tell you that before you have fulfilled your obligations? Do not take me for a fool. Bro, I can do no reason not to trust me. You must understand why we are suspicious of you. Most American vigilantes come here to help the rebels. It is strange you have chosen to work for the army. I'm not working for you. How many times do I have to say this? Call it what you want, gringo. We are exchanging favors. And I've got zero favors. See, many favors come my See? Way. like we're all easy. Abraham Reyes is trying hard to recruit gringos to fight for him. Why don't I just Probably talk to him? Everywhere. He promises women, gold, and of course you come. Money and the chance to interfere in business that is not your own. How can any American resist? I've done everything you've asked of me. If Belinde doesn't give me a squela in Williamson after this, I think it's best I go ask the rebels to talk to him. The threat, yes. You are only alive right now because of me. No. Nope. I'm tired of this, bro. It's literally everybody I had to do like 15 tasks just to get where I want to go. I'm tired of this. Here we are at last. Soldados, abordamos the train. Look at that Gatling gun. My worst enemy. I do not think we have seen the last of the rebels. You recruits can't win a fight like this. I need you to man the Gatling gun. I ain't the soldier here, Captain. Do not question me, gringo. Just do as I say. Vamonos! Mante anse alerta! Get behind that gun. I am not taking any chance. Can I get... Wait, get, get off. No. I'm not using this thing, bro. Can't be that hard. Just point and pull the trigger. For Dios, we will all be killed. Don't worry, Captain. I've used one of these before. For a cold-hearted killer, you're an anxious son of a bitch, ain't you? We have already been ambushed. Our squad is made up of new recruits and the two men that Santa hates the most. I think it is right to be anxious. Yeah, well, I wasn't exactly expecting a pleasant picnic by the seaside myself. Over there! It's the rebels! Yep. I need to get out of here! No. They best give me a squeal after this. I'm telling you. Don't worry about that later. You must hold them back. Keep them away from the steam engine. If they kill the engineers, we will all be slaughtered. You cannot let them kill the driver. Oh, brother, I might actually have to. Little goofy fell off the dang horse. I blatantly don't think I have to reload as long as I switch weapons and just use it for a little. 
I literally don't think he had the reload, which might be my strat for the rest of this gameplay. Are you crazy? That gun is our only hope. No, it isn't. Yep, that's the strat. I literally don't have to reload. For the rest of the rest of the series, I'm not reloading. Okay, bro. Wait, wait, wait. It's time. There's no, like, he really didn't want us to live through this. Like, I think that's easy to tell, but, like, he really, really, really didn't want us to live through this. If I hear that sound effect one more time, are we done? I hate using this thing so much. Like, what a passion. Nope, we're not done. Wait, I could just shoot? Wait, how did that happen? Hold up, bro. I'm breaking games. First of all, the base camp is just at the top of the hill. That was madness. You did well, compadre. Very well. Whatever I can promise you in return, you have earned it. I don't think the Santa expected us to come back from this. No. You want to kill him? Or should I? No. Until I find a squala, he's more used to me a lot. Yo. I could just do that for any gun, too. Yo. See, I need to start trying things like that. If we ever play an older game, bro, I got to start just, like, trying to pick it apart. We are lucky to be alive. Go to the camp. The base commander will want to speak to you. Senor Bo Senor Marston, thank you for your efforts. The escort was a success. No problem. At least some of your men survived. I didn't think to survive myself. My whole life I have dreamed of a glorious death. <laughs> Vamos! 
Rapido antes uh, que nos ataquen otra vez. The socialist pigs cannot be allowed to win. Dang, all I got is that one girl. Okay. I guess let's go there. I can't believe I failed like the method though. Hold up, tap in. You want the method? Tap in. Slot me quick 15, I'll make sure it's 30. Come on, cash app, now. <laughs> I said 15, but they be asking for like 100. What the heck? What happened? Este es el gringo que me salvó. Muchas gracias. Uh, my family is indebted to you. Forgive my English. What's happening? Great and terrible things. The revolution is coming. The country will be in turmoil once more. This time, we hope it's the last time. Does that seem likely? No. Abraham Reyes, anything is possible. Oh. Where's your family going? My parents and my brother are headed to the hills. My sister has to flee. The army have an unfortunate way of treating women. And you? Don't worry about me, Mr. Marston. I'm living in history. I'm not afraid to die. Um... Your nobility is almost as affecting as your naivete. I would rather be dead than a cynic like you, Mr. Marston. Okay. I would too. I know you're not really like that. You saved me. Uh, Luisa, ¿quién va a salvar a Miranda? Tenemos que llevar al puerto su barco, sale al anochecer. No queda tiempo. Mr. Marston, can I ask one more favor of you? Can you take my sister to the docks? We are sending her to work for a kind man in the Yucatan. She's too young for revolution. Okay. Anything I can do to help out? The boat leaves at sundown. Miranda, vamos. Ten cuidado. Adios. Emilio works as a driver. We will take his stagecoach. There's no way people are going to attack us, right? Mm -hmm. Up on, girl. It is not too far. I will show you the way. Okay, okay, no, it's just a race. Race against time. A race you'll never win. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Write that down, you know? I'd be make. I know you're. I. No. Pare! Papeles! Este camino está prohibido! Hola! What do they want now? Act normal. It's nothing to worry about. Te conozco. Eres un pinche rebelde. Hola. Don't worry about shooting. Who did that? The army is everywhere looking for rebels. We need to avoid any checkpoints we see. I'm not going to shoot, bro. I am not shooting. I'm worried about nothing but going. No shooting, just going. Now I'm rolling. What is that? Is that a zebra? Oh, that's a horse. Move! Go turn! Go straight through it! Turn it up! You are too young to be in this, girl. I am sorry. Go to the right. Master, we cannot slow down. You have to load them, senor. We must not reveal the location of the boat. No. Gang got me, bro. That really works. That you just saw it work. That really works. <laughs> Look, straight ahead. Quick, take this left. Um. Okay. Don't let them stop us now. We are nearly there. Dumba 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 d
<laughs> Get out of here, girl. Thank you for everything. Will I see you when I return? No. Not likely. I ain't planning on staying very long. In some other life, then. Maybe. You should get going. Travel safely. Good guy, John Marston. Do 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 do. Could have took the grandma with you. Beautiful music. I love to hear it. <sighs> All right, I'm back. What happened? Must a savior die? What happened? Oh, Mr. Marston. Mr. Marston. What's wrong, Louisa? I don't wait for myself, but for my country. Abram Reyes has been captured. He has? He was coming to meet me at Roca Madera. It's a very romantic spot. It was a beautiful night, and he was ambushed by patrol. My heart is breaking, but I cry for Mexico. Uh, where is he being held? El Presidio. You know, in our hearts, we are married already, but his family do not approve. How could they? When well, I'm little more than a peasant girl. But that's what makes Abram the man he is. He doesn't care for their bourgeois, snobbery, or elitism. He sees the real me. The woman. I'm sure. I'm going to go and rescue him or die trying. Girl, if you don't sit your little stupid self down. That's such a good idea. I got I it. Need to near the jail. We'll figure out how to rescue him. Mr. Marston, you are truly a friend of this land. So everyone keeps informing me. Let's go, Mr. Marston. I'm here. Tabitha. Oh, you want me to ride this damn... Dang, are the horses supposed to look like that? Why ain't he being fed? Where the food at? He's the leader of the rebels, right? So we're about to go save the... Oh my gosh, we're about to be in the middle of things, huh? Honestly, I'd rather go with the rebels. They they probably talking down on them in the army, but I wouldn't be surprised if they're a lot better, bro. They doing some crap, bro. Ew, but the ew. We are almost there. He is still alive. I feel it. Uh, I feel like somebody else has said that. And then they ended up dying. El Presidio. There it is. You have to find the way in. Oh, I know You're one. There is a partially broken down wall. You should be able to scramble over it. Hurry, but please be careful. There are guards everywhere. If they see you, they will kill you both. Well, if he's alive, I'll try to make sure he stays that way. Good luck. Que Dios te proteja. You Thank you. You have God on your side. All right. Hallelujah. Go to a sniping position. Oh, brother. Finish the executioner. Is this him? Well, I hope that was him. It's John Marston! I'm American! Hey, ride the, ride the beat. Hey, ride the beat. Hey, I beat my meat. Hey, I ride the beat. Hey, I hit the boot. Uh, I hit the boot. Uh, I hit the, I hit the, hit the, hit the boot. Uh, I ride the beat. Uh, I beat my meat. Uh, and then I ski. Uh, there goes the beat. Sorry, my friend, send me free. Victoria, now please cut me free, senor. Got you, man. I'm getting better at not pressing a button. We have to meet her by the river. Okay? Luisa, the girl you're marrying. Oh, yes. Such a devoted thing. El amor de mi vida. Oh, brother. Are, are, are all of you the same, bro? I thought you were going to be better. Oh, hell nah. Tabitha? Where Tabitha at? Come on, Tabitha. Tabitha. Nope, Tabitha. You got to make me feel the mission. I'm getting Tabitha. Get away from me, dirty, dumb. <laughs> I phone. Vamos, let's hurry to Luisa. Luisa. Come. Come on, easy up there. 
Luisa, send me. Vamos, get the prisa. The army is coming. Atrás, look out. Did I shoot him? Like, what, what, what was that? Wait, maybe the spring fell does more damage. I can easily record. What is your name, my friend? John Marston. No, oh, the American who was working for Allende. I ain't working for nobody. I'm here because Luisa asked for my help. As I thought you were a friend of Allende's, I was planning on putting a bullet in your back. Well, try to resist the urge. Go ahead, try me. My young lover, Laura. It's Luisa. I saved her life not so long back. I will not forget this, compadre. You will be rewarded. Money, women. You're just Luisa, the same. If you want her. I'm here Bro, you're for you, And that's it. You'll be spending too much time with Captain De Santa. Very funny. Not like that. I'll explain later. <laughs> I am free again. I will write a poem about this day. This is from a man who was tied to a post with a gun in his face a few minutes ago. I wish I could see I get in this face when he finds out he defeated a hundred of his men. <laughs> All you've done is get on the back of this horse, my friend, and you barely manage that. You've been spending too much time with the Santa. <laughs> There she is. I remember her now. Mi amiga. Does she dare get her name wrong? I am Mr. Marston. Oy. The revolution will live on thanks to you. Yes, indeed, John. You are as a brother to me. And my people need a man such as you to help our cause. Just tell me where these two people my are. In Agave Viejo, and let me say, my brother, that we await you. Well, best of luck to both of you, but. I need to find two men so I can return to America. Mm, no problem. I will help you find those men. And in return, you will win a people her freedom. Viva Mexico! Yeah! yeah. Bye, John. Vente conmigo. Tu sabes que en esta luz puedo ver... 